Hello everybody of YouTube. Today, I'm going to share with you a little model I built of how a uh, standard electrical distribution system works in the United States. So let's get started with my model utility bowl I built here out of a pencil and a toothpick. Now how this works is the toothpick here, the green thing, represents the cross arm and obviously the pencil represents the wooden pole. Now, the way an actual distribution system works is you see these three wires? One, two, and three right here, the three wires here. These are called the primary phases, or primary wires of a distribution system. That you would see normally on the top of the utility pole on the insulators. So, these wires are usually energized at around uh, 7,200 volts in the U.S. So these wires here, these, these three, are around 7,200 volts. So, you're probably wondering what this little yellow thing is right here. Well, this represents what a transformer looks like. Now, a transformer is normally the large uh, gray uh, cil cylinder-shaped things uh, you see on the poles. Now, if you have overhead distribution, like I do, you will have two wires going into the top of the transformer. You have your one wire, which is a primary. Uh, you know, it goes to the primary coils of the transformer, primary winding. And the second wire, which is fused with a fused cutout, which would blow if there was an overload. And those, both of those wires go into the top of the transformer. And out of the transformer comes 120 volts AC. As you can see right here by my homemade service drop I made right there, you have three wires that come out of the transformer, which are your hot, neutral, and of course your negative. So you have your bare wire, which is the neutral, and your two 120 volt insulated wires, which run along a service drop, which normally looks like this. It's this little wire down here. But it usually has three wires that are wrapped together. They're twisted together like this. And we're pretending this round thing over here is our building. Like a building that would get electrical power. And the power would come in through the weather head and go into the meter. Which then would distri just distribute the power throughout the rest of the building. So that's basically how it works. Oh, and these other wires here, I just put there kind of for a demonstration, because sometimes you have those hooked up to lightning arresters. So right here, let's say if there was a lightning arrestor right there, the three wires would be connected to the lightning arrestor. So that's basically how it works. So you'd have your, your three wires, main distribution lines, that would go to each pole. And then you'd have your little transformer, which takes the 7,200 volts, and converts it to 120 volts to uh, be safely brought into your home by the service drop. So I hope you enjoyed my little uh, demonstration slash model of how an electrical distribution system works. If you have any questions or comments, please leave them below. Don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe. Thank you very much. Goodbye.